Um, is it starting? It says it's starting. I don't think it's actually started. Oh, oh I'm live now, I think. Um, it's been a while since I used Facebook live streaming and they've changed it a lot. Uh, okay, I, I think this is working. Um, I should probably check it though, although I don't know if I can see that on my own account. <laughs> I know, I know. Oh, well, yeah, it's up in stories and stuff. Okay, okay, I'm gonna assume this is working. Um, I don't think anybody's watching yet, or maybe ever, which might be a good thing. What I'm gonna try to do, sorry, my hands are sweaty already. I even like turned the heater off because I was getting nervous and hot. And all oh, thanks, honey. <laughs> I'm verified that it started fine. Um, good to know. So what I'm gonna be doing is singing or playing and singing, hopefully, some Christmas carols for all of you. Um, but the the I can't think of the word. The gimmick. Yeah, we, there we go. There's a gimmick here. The gimmick is I've never played these songs on ukulele ever. Um, I found a couple of sites that said like five to ten simple Christmas carols. And I just glanced at the chords that were involved and I recognized the chords. That does not mean that the song is going to be a good key for my voice. Uh, so I might be singing real high or real low. Or... It doesn't mean I'm gonna play it flawlessly whether I know the chords or not. Um, it just means I'm gonna try. And I figure, you know, it's Christmas Eve and I don't know about you guys, but for me and Adam, that means staying at home because Omicron sucks and COVID can suck it. Uh, so we're not, we're not seeing anybody except for each other, which is wonderful and enough. Absolutely. I love my husband so much. Uh, I'm so very glad to have him and not be just completely alone. Um, but I know there are probably more than just us who have decided to, to stay home this Christmas. Um, or even if you're with friends and family right now, y'all might be bored and want something funny haha, to watch for a few minutes while I attempt to do this. Um, so I'm just going to start with the first song on the first page that I found and we'll go from there. And I'm probably, thanks for the hearts, honey. Uh, I'm probably going to have to be scrolling every once in a while with my mouse as I'm playing because I d just inevitably, the songs never fit on the screen. That's why I always have to print it out. Uh, <laughs> if you've seen any of my other ukulele videos. Um, yeah, this thing does not tell me if anybody's watching this. Like, I know you are, honey. Oh, there's viewers down. There. Okay, we got two people. Oh, oh, I just lost one. Never mind. Uh, <laughs> this might just be for my husband, and then the rest of you can watch it later, and that's totally fine, too. But I thought I would try to bring a little Christmas cheer to anyone who might need it. So, okay, I'm thankfully this page anyway shows the chords first. And then the song. So I'm just gonna run through these chords, make sure I remember what they are. D7. Okay, I hadn't used that one in a while. I'll remember that though, I think. Here we go! At least it starts with MSC. That's usually a good sign. Oh, I didn't tell you what song this was. What is this? Uh, Jingle Bells! Who did it say it was by? James Lord Pierpont. I'm not gonna read the little description. I'm just gonna try to sing the song. <laughs> Here we go! Song number one! Dashing through the snow And a one horse open sleigh O'er the fields we go Laughing all the way Bells on bobtails ring Making spirits bright What fun it is to laugh and sing a slaying song tonight Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way Oh, G7? Did it say G7 up there? No? It lied. Is that supposed to be C7? Okay. Uh, all the way. Oh, that doesn't sound right either. Oh, what fun it is to write. Yeah, they got a note wrong in there. Um, told you this was going to be interesting. It's to write in a one or 
eyes open sleigh. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. I don't know what note that's supposed to be. Okay, I guess that does sound right. It just didn't sound right the first time. And they didn't tell me that that note was going to be in here. How dare they? Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. Scrolling down. <laughs> a day or two ago, I thought I'd take a ride and soon Miss Rainbow Bright. <laughs> Seeing the Rainbow Bright version. <laughs> Rainbow Bright was seated by my side. The horse was lean and lank. Misfortune seemed his lot. We got into a drifted bank and then we got upset. Oh, scroll again. <laughs> jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is. Song number one. Um, <laughs> I'm back to two viewers, so, so somebody other than my husband is watching now. Hi, whoever you are. <laughs> um, that was interesting. So the other thing I've got to keep in mind while playing these songs is they don't put the chord changes where I would put the chord changes. Like, I'm trying to find a quick example. So yeah, the G7 was actually right. What fun! But they say to change on the end of fun. Oh, what fun it is! You change on is, not end of fun. So some of this I'm just I know because I know how to. I guess I've been doing this long enough that I can just look at that and be like, no, that's not where it's supposed to change. Um, but that's why I messed up at the end because it's like. You know what? No. Yeah. Let's to ride in a one horse up. <laughs> yeah. We're supposed to be one horse open sleigh. That should that C should be on sleigh. So okay, there's there's gonna be a little bit of um imperfection just because the the music's wrong. So you can't blame me for that one. <laughs> All right, let's let's go to song number two. Um, I'm dreaming of a white Christmas by Irving Berlin. I'm just saying what it's not. Yeah, it's got a whole little paragraph sung by Bing Crosby. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, let me make sure I remember the notes. I know G, A minor, D. I hope it's not a lot of Ds. D7, I just used, yep, an E minor. Cool. Oh, this looks like, like it has a lot of changes in it. Um, okay, let's, let's see. See, sometimes I also have to think, like, what's the note I'm starting on? Because it doesn't tell me. Okay. I'm... I'll start it low. Hopefully it won't be too low. I'm dreaming of... See, where's that... So many changes in here, y'all. I'm dreaming of a white. Excuse me? There's not enough time to go from. This is what it wants me to do. I'm dreaming of a white Christmas. See, I'm just gonna ignore one of those. Um, just like the ones I used to know where the tree where the sorry tree tops glisten and children listen to hear sleigh bells in the snow okay I'm dreaming 
of a white Christmas. That D should not even be there. I'm going to start that one over and just scroll a little bit while I'm at it. Okay. <laughs> I'm dreaming of a white Christmas with every Christmas card I write. May your days be merry and bright. And may all your Christmas be white. This is why I edit my songs before I play them for y'all. I'm dreaming of... No, it doesn't go there. Okay. I'm dreaming of a white Christmas Just like the ones I used There needs to be something there. The ones I used to know They have the lines backwards. That's why it looks weird. Okay, let me, let me just do that part again. And is this the same as the first? It is. It's the same as the first verse. Is that the way it's supposed to go? I thought there were more than just two verses to this. I'm sorry, y'all. It, it just, it's first verse, second verse, and then just repeats. But you know, I, I know what I'm doing a little better now, so maybe I'll play the, it doesn't go any further? Nope, okay. We're just gonna pretend that that was a practice run. Yeah. <laughs> this is second, third verse, I don't know. I think I know what I'm doing now with the notes at least. This site is wrong. Okay. Um. I'm dreaming of a white Christmas Just like the ones I used to know Where the treetops glisten And children listen to hear So by the last verse, I sort of kind of had that one. It's not my site. It's not my my site. Well, it's not my site, obviously, but it's also not my fault. Oh, hi, Mia. I was just singing White Christmas or trying to. It was a really bad version. Uh, <laughs> Uh, the version I, in, in, as in version, I mean, the site that I'm reading these off of, the notes were not in the right order for half of it. So, yeah, that that's not my bad. I, I'm, I'm learning it as fast as I can, y'all. I'm like, seriously, you know what um, cold reading is? Like, any of you who have ever done any theater, um, y'all know what a cold read is. That's where they stick a script in front of you and they just tell you to read a part like as if you are just that character and you're you're acting it out but you've never read it before so you're just like doing it on the fly that's what this is this is a cold play i wonder if that's where the band coldplay got their name that's cute if it is not that i'm a fan i'm just saying it's a cute name um yeah i'm i'm playing these cold like not necessarily singing cold, but sort of, because I, I never know what key they're going to be in. So they may or may not be a good key for my voice. Like, that last one was kind of low, but I could hit the notes, so good enough. Uh, but it's not necessarily the key I would have chosen. But this is the easy versions, so I'm just going to have to go with what they give me. I'm just practicing the, the notes for the next one. I hate B minor so much. 
Okay. And A. Okay, this one is apparently rocking around the Christmas tree. Oh, but it doesn't have a whole lot of changes. That's good. Because that was the other thing with the last one. Like, it would have five chord changes on one line. I'm like, I can't even talk that fast, much less change notes that fast. So... See, I think the changes are in the wrong spot again. I'm just going to... Rocking around the Christmas tree at the Christmas party up. Mistletoe hung where you can see every couple tries to stop. Rocking around the Christmas tree, let the Christmas spirit ring. Later we'll have some pumpkin pie and we'll do some caroling. You will get a sentimental feeling when you hear <laughs> that chord. Voices singing, let's be jolly. Deck the house with boughs of holly, rocking around. The Christmas tree, have a happy holiday. Everyone dancing merrily in the new old fashioned way. I scroll down again. <laughs> you will get a scent. I think that's later anyway. You will get a sentimental. How you were mm. you should see this tablature or whatever you want to call this it's just it's got the words and it's got the chords right above the words and where the chord is above the word is where you're supposed to change this is the most ridiculous thing i've ever seen it literally has d d d d g c g <laughs> like if it's the same note you don't have to repeat the thing on the i'm really curious how that's supposed to end I know how the song like ends, like I know the song, but everyone dancing merrily in the new in the new no in the new old in the new old fashioned way. See, it should not have a G before that C. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I'm gonna like write the people of who own this website and be like, you need to change, you need to fix your songs. Yes, they are simple, but they're also a little more compli complex, complicated, whatever, than they need to be. That could have been a whole lot simpler. Everyone dancing merrily in the new old fashioned Okay, sorry, that, that was a little mm, rough, but I think all of these are going to be rough, and I, I think that's okay. Um, Mia has been lazy with her ukulele, you need to play it more. Yes, you do, young lady. I would love to see you play some videos uh, playing your ukulele and singing. I know you've got a gorgeous voice. Come on, do it. Hey, Lainey! <laughs> What's up, girl? <laughs> Um, I'm glad y'all are joining me for this ridiculous version of Christmas caroling. Like, I, I feel a little, um, what's the word? Subconscious? No. Uh, 
there's a word for this. Like, I, I feel like it would be cool to go around to the neighbors with my ukulele and sing a song for them, but I'm too, I'm too nervous to do that. Um, Paul says, Katie, be on the song 20 minutes later, like pulling my hair out frantically. Yeah, probably. Yeah, probably. <laughs> this site is going to be my undoing. And this is just the first one. Maybe I should just skip right to the second site. I don't know. Yeah, Merry Christmas to you too, Lainey and Paul and Mia and everyone else who watches this now or later. Um, yeah, I, I wish I could be with you guys in person, but hey, next best thing, right? Uh, me butchering some Christmas carols for y'all. <laughs> But it's not my fault. It's because I have literally never played these before and I'm doing it for the first time for your amusement and mine. Come on. This makes me laugh too. Uh, next is Winter Wonderland by Richard B. Smith and Felix Bernard. Oh, this has, oh no. Oh dear. This has F sharp in it. Oh, but I think, oh, and real E. Oh, I may not be doing this one. I may be skipping this. Let me see where those notes are. Oh, yeah, y'all don't want me to play that one. Why is this saying that B minor and B are the same? They are not. Okay, I'm going to skip that for everyone's sake. Uh, I Maybe I can find another version of it on a different side. <laughs> because I like that song. But that's got some notes in it that I cannot do. Let's just, let's just say that. Um, so next one, that one, this one looks easy. Yes, okay. Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, everyone's favorite. And just practicing my chords real quick. C, G, E minor, A minor, A7, D7, and D. Okay. Oh, oh, I've got some changes. Hopefully it won't be too bad. I'm trying to figure out where the note starts. Uh, mm. See, again, it's got the note, the change is like, I think way too early. Okay, I just wanted to verify that that was <laughs> what it was wanting me to do. I think so. <clears throat> it's got all of those notes before the last syllable of dancer. There are four names in this line and it's on the second name. Mm. That's okay. That's why I have a little bit of experience to draw on here, which which helps. Okay. You know Dasher and Dancer and Prancer and Vixen, Comet and Cupid and Donna and Blitzen, but... Wrong note. But do you recall the most famous reindeer of all? We scroll down. <laughs> Rudolph the red nosed reindeer had a very shiny nose. And if you ever saw it. I hope y'all are saying, like, saw it. Okay. Yeah. You would even say it glows. All of the other reindeer used to laugh and call him names. They never let poor Rudolph it's join, not play. Join in any reindeer games. Scrolling. See, I know the lyrics better than the site does. Then one. Oh my god, I just lost my note. Um. <laughs> reindeer games. Yeah. Then one foggy Christmas Eve, Santa came to say, Rudolph, with your nose so bright, won't you guide my sleigh tonight? Then how the reindeer loved him. They shouted out with glee, Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, you'll go down in history, like Alexander Hamilton. I'm kidding. <laughs> it's like, you know, George Washington is the one we always sang as kids, but now I think it's funnier to say Alexander Hamilton. 
because I love Hamilton. <laughs> oh, I love this. To get the most out of these songs, we recommend memorizing their chord progressions and practicing to the <laughs> practicing them to the slow click of a metronome. Focus on transitioning from chord to chord slowly before adding in vocals. With a little focusing and work, you'll be playing these holiday favorites in no time. Or you could just do like me and just play them without ever looking at them before and tell you how wrong you are. What 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 is this site? Popuband.com. Yeah, it's just P O P U, the letter U, band. Popuband.com. You are my naughty list. Uh, are there, are there more? It said next for more. Oh, I think that was just, what is, the, okay. That must have been the end of their Christmas carols. Okay. Don't worry. Don't worry. I have a couple other sides up just in case. Um, I've already done Jingle Bells. Okay. Do to the, is this a link? What is this? Why is there a guitar on my mouse? <laughs> that is such a like late 90s maybe early 2000s web thing to do where they change your mouse pointer to look like something else when you're on their site and yeah I literally put a little well I guess it's a ukulele yeah this is uke tabs dot it's not even uke uku uku tabs dot com and it's got like yeah I thought it was a guitar but it's just a, a ukulele on my mouse pointer that's hilarious but uh that's not a link what are you? Oh, 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 there's the link. Okay. It just showed like the chords and that was it. <laughs> I was like, I don't have the song memorized necessarily, like the words. Okay. This really one has three chords in it. That, oh my God, there's ads everywhere. Okay. Ugutabs.com. You can chill with your ads. Okay. Uh, I think there's gonna be a lot of scrolling here because it's a little spread out, but that's that's probably good. And hopefully these are in the right spot. Oh, let me b go back and see if y'all have said anything else uh, before I continue. Um, so I've known you before you were <laughs> I still ain't famous girl, but you're adorable for thinking I am. Uh, Mika York. Merry Christmas, Mika! Yes, and Merry Christmas to everyone else. The tones, Katie, we need to find the tones. Oh my God, Paul. You know, I never thought about the He-Man movie being a Christmas special, but I, I think it should be. Um, Matt Charles, Merry Christmas to you too. Yes, I, I really want to watch the He-Man movie now. <laughs> I've got to find the tones. Oh, oh, okay. Hopefully, hopefully this one will go better than the other site. Fingers crossed, y'all. Joy to the world, the Lord is come. Let earth receive a king. Let every heart prepare him room. Heaven and nature sing, and heaven and nature sing, and heaven. And heaven and heaven and nature sing. Can't trust this site either. They put a random C chord in there that's totally unnecessary. Okay, next verse. Joy to the world, the Savior reigns. Let men their songs employ. While fields and plots, rocks, hills, and plains Repeat the sounding joy, repeat the sounding joy Repeat, repeat the sounding joy Why would floods repeat the sounding joy? No, anyway, verse 3! <clears throat> No more let sins and sorrows grow, nor thorns infest the ground. It's been a long time since I've sung all of these verses. He comes to make his blessings flow, far as the curse is found, far as the curse is found, far as as far as the curse is found. One more verse, okay. He 
rules the world with truth and grace and makes the nations prove the glories of his righteousness and wonders of his love and wonders of his love and wonders wonders of his love <laughs> yay that one was like in my in my in my range almost in my key range i don't think that's a thing um i was in a good range for my voice is what i'm trying to say and then the chords were mostly where they needed to be yeah there's just that random c in there that i don't know how that's supposed to even fit in but I don't remember, I mean, I remember some of the words from the second verse. The third one, maybe we skipped that verse when we sang this in church. <laughs> you know how the choir director will be like, okay, we're singing verses one, two, and four. And you just have to remember. And like, I was good at that as a kid, but I remember other people around me would start singing the wrong words and I'd just like be giggling inside. I mean, I wouldn't actually laugh at them if it was in church. That would have been rude. Uh, <laughs> But in my head, I'm like, you didn't listen to the choir director, and I did. <laughs> yes, I'm telling y'all what a horrible person I am and have always been, apparently. Um, Kate, yes, Lainey, you could tell them all the stories from 1998 to 2001. <laughs> but please don't. Oh, dear God, please don't. <laughs> we had some real good times in there, though. We had some real good times. Uh, especially at York Tech in the computer lab. I'm just saying, that was a place to be. <laughs> oh, ooh, Feliz Navidad. Um, I mean, the chords are easy. We'll, we'll see. It wanted me to do Melakaliki Naka, but that's got, or Maka, sorry. Melakaliki Maka. I always thought it was an N for some reason when I heard the song, but it's got way too many chords. And some of them... Well, is that the only hard one? Hold on. Can I play B7? I'm not sure I've done that one before. Ooh, ooh, how do you, mm, mm Oh, oh, it wants you to do this. I mean, I can try. Oh, but what? They've got a completely different D7. No, this, this D7, thank you. They want me to do this. No, thanks. I'll do this. I know it sounds different, but it might work. Let's let's try one that's gonna just, we know it's gonna be bad. Oh, oh, look how nice of them. They have lyrics and ukulele tabs. Easy. And then lyrics and ukulele tabs. I'll go with the easy one. So maybe it'll be less of a disaster. I, I can't make any promises. This is showing all the same chords as the page before it did. So... A... Flat diminished seven, excuse you? You didn't tell me that was in this. What? Oh, I should not have clicked on that. Apparently that takes me to a, where am I? A flat, dim it doesn't even show me a flat diminished seven. Where are you? Yeah, I think this song is destined for failure. It took me to like a page of A chords, I guess. Yeah, okay, there's the, mm, 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 yeah, it's even on the something M7, I guess it's the seventh. Uh, there's no like flat diminished seven though on here, there's just something diminished, it's something, oh no, there's a diminished seven, but that's not flat diminished seven, it's just diminished seven. Let's see what that looks like. What? I'm so confused right now. I okay. Never mind. Never mind. Bad idea. Um. By the way, though, speaking of Hawaii, uh, <laughs> this Malakaliki Maka made me think because it's a Hawaiian song. Um. If y'all have not seen the new Doogie Howser show, it's adorable. Like it's not the best show on TV. I forget what station it's on. station. What am I talking about? This isn't the radio. What channel? But even then, like, who does channels anymore? We stream everything. Um, honey, darling, if you're still watching, um, 
<laughs> I'll get Adam to tell y'all which service it's on. I can't remember if it's a Disney show. I think it might be. I think it might be on Disney Plus. The Christmas. Oh, oh, the the. Mm, I don't think I know. Wait, did I do that last year? Remind me, Paul, if I if I sing that song last year. I may have. I feel like I've done that song on ukulele. He's asking. He's requesting the. Oh, and that. Doogie Hauser is on Disney Plus. Thank you, darling. I thought so. Um, he's requesting the Masters of the Universe Christmas special song. Oh, wait, wait, wait. That's a different song. I don't think I've done that one on ukulele yet, but that would be hilarious. No, the one I did, I think it was the, the Secret of the Sword song. Yeah, I think I did that one at some point. I have not tabbed out or corded out, whatever you want to call it, the Christmas song. I've got to do that. <laughs> well, Paul, you know, that's that's my face half the time when playing them, so I, I get it. Um, and at the beginning, it didn't show that. Like, the chords it had listed out, it didn't show anything funky like that. It was all just A, A7, A minor, B7, D, D7, E7, E minor 7, G. Like, not so bad. And then I got in there, the easy version, and it wants me to play some dimin flat diminished seven, and it doesn't even tell me how to play it. So that's getting skipped. Let's try another foreign song. Uh, since I can't do Hawaiian, let's try Feliz Navidad. Because I think that one's easy. It looks like it anyway. Um, <laughs> oh, my hand is so sweaty. <laughs> okay. I need some like cornstarch to stick my hand in and get my ukulele real dirty while I play it. That's okay. Accent was that in? I don't even know. <laughs> Hold on, I gotta see what note this starts on. Oh, I have to be able to read Spanish? Oh, like the, the chorus is not in Spanish, but this verse, I, I'm sorry to anyone out there who speaks Spanish. I'm going to butcher this, but it'll be in the best possible way, right? Oh my God. Here we go. I think, I think I'm on the right note. Please. Nope. Mm, I lost it already. Uh. Sometimes I have to play the chords for a second, and then I can figure out. Okay. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Prospero. I'm a dork. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Prospero año y felicidad. I want to wish you a Merry Christmas. I want to wish you a Merry Christmas. I want to wish you a Merry Christmas from the bottom. Merry 
Christmas. I wanna wish you a Merry Christmas from the bottom of my heart. I wanna wish you a Merry Christmas. I wanna wish you a Merry Christmas. I wanna wish you a Merry Christmas from the bottom of my heart. <laughs> At least the chords were. I think all in the right spot on that one. Yay! Ukutabs.com. You, you got one thing going for you. Uh, <laughs> wait, what is this? Hold on. <laughs> I gotta go back over here. Um, um, the next one is showing me... Oh, oh, wait. B minor and D... F Ooh. See, it's not showing me the chords. It, I'm guessing it will on the actual page for the song. Let's see. Uh, ooh. Mm. Ew, D flat. Oh, heck no. It wants me to do hold down the three at the top and then do one, two, three, four down. What? This. I mean, that could sound worse, but. How often is it in the song? If it's only like once? Oh, don't be one of those songs. What is this? Um, mm, mm, mm. It's got way too many changes that I think are completely unnecessary. And the first one is B minor. Wait. Mm. So B minor. Really? Okay. Where was the D flat? It had it in one place so far that I've seen, but it's A slash D flat. So I'm like, which one is it? You gotta choose one. You can't have them both at the same time. So if I can just play the A's, I might be able to pull this off. I make no guarantees about the B minors sounding great, uh, but they're better than the D flats would be. Practice the B minor one more time. Oh, my my hand is already getting a little tired because it's been a while since I played um, like a bunch. So, but let's see. I don't think it's in. Oh yes, it is in here a lot. Hold on, I just want to see how bad this is. <laughs> <laughs> Stop the ringing. Check the halls with boughs of holly. <laughs> That's what it wants me to do. No, let me let me see if I can simplify this. Check the halls with boughs of holly. Didn't you do any of that? Fa la 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 la. Really? Fa la 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 la. Was that in the law? No, you. Let me just start over. Mm, okay, okay. I, I think I can do this with just D and A. Maybe? Wait, it's. Mm, don't mess with me. Now I'm showing an E down there. Oh, there's an E up there. But that's a simpler E than I've seen before. I still don't think I can play it though. Uh. Nah, see. Mm. <sighs> this is why I don't play songs that have E in them. I should have seen that E. But it's only in there like what once? Maybe I can skip it. <laughs> Let's just try the first verse and see how bad it is. <laughs> I might just move on to a different song altogether. Check the halls with boughs of holly. No, sorry. La 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 la. Tis the season to be jolly. Fa la 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 la. Don we now our gay apparel? La la la. La 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 la. See, I told you I could skip the E. Troll? Really? Is that the word? Troll the ancient Christmas carol. La 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 See, see, half the time 
you look at these things and you're like, oh no, B minor is hard. Ooh, E is hard. Most of the time you can skip them if they're in like a run like this. It's completely unnecessary. Okay, scrolling down. But troll? Really troll? I didn't know that was the word. Troll the ancient Christmas Is that like trill kind of? Like that's trill? It's a thing you do with your voice and singing, I think. But troll? Mm, I only know one definition of that word and it's not something you do at Christmas or you, it's not a verb it's a, it's a noun it's a fantasy thing okay okay see the blazing you'll be for us la 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 strike the harp and join the chorus la 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 Christmas treasure la 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 Scrolling down again I think this is the last verse Fast Fast away the old year passes la 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 Hail the new year lads and lasses la 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 edited out their BS. It wasn't that bad. It was just, if you ever want to, you know, practice going between D and A a heck of a lot, this is your song, because that's almost all it was. I did have to use the B minor in the whatever, where was that? The second, no, third, fa la 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 la. Yeah, you needed that there. But the rest of it, oh, and there's a G. Mm hmm There's one G in every verse, but the rest of it's all A and D in that key anyway, unless you want to do their fancy nonsense, which who who would want to do that? Who, why? Why make it harder on yourself? That's why I look at some of these sites and I'm just like, huh? Um, James, hi James, lovely singing voice, Katie, I'm very impressed. Well, thank you. It's, it's not great right now because I've not practice these songs ever. Um, I'm totally singing these off a, off the cuff, off of a website I found for simple Christmas carols on the ukulele. Um, so they may or may not be in the right key for my voice. And I, when I'm messing up, I inevitably start laughing or doing something silly. So that, of course, messes with my voice too. But thanks anyway. I'm just going to take the compliment and stop. Um, <laughs> making excuses for myself. I don't know what I'm doing. Check the guy who wrote this tab sheet. Yes. Thank you, Paul. Okay. So Adam, to troll a song is simply to sing it in a full rolling voice per the internet. Thank you. Learned a new verb today. A full, am I using a full rolling voice, y'all? I don't know. I don't know about that. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I'm using a voice. I'm not sure which one it is, but... Uh, okay, this one looks really easy as far as the chords go. I know the song frontwards and backwards. Um, is it really that easy? G, F... Oh, sorry. C, F, G, and G7. Nice. Okay. Silent Night. One of my favorites. Let's let's see if if the chords are right on this one. Let's, let's fingers crossed. Oh, whoa, 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 what just happened? <laughs> Either I lost the internet or just that page. It really, literally, just said like page can be found <laughs> when I was about to start playing it. Maybe it's mad that I'm closing out all those stupid ads. Um, okay, Silent Night, y'all. <sighs> yep, gonna dry off my hand again. 
And I think this is a good key. Let's see, let's see. Silent night, holy night, all is calm, all is bright, round yon virgin mother and child, holy infant so tender and mild sleep in heavenly peace it's a little high sleep in heavenly peace wasn't terrible um did the other page crash too sorry it's the same site it was just <laughs> they had a little um they had a little uh, server problem there for a second i think maybe a lot of people are trying to play these ridiculous songs um and i'm looking at the rest of these like can it, i don't know if i can best that last one maybe i should just go out on a high literal note um <laughs> I'm definitely not singing 12 Days of Christmas. I already did that one, right? Yeah, I did White Christmas. Um, they've also got Winter Wonderland, but it's, nope, too hard. Already did Rudolph. Okay, do I have any other sites? Uh, no, I cannot do Malakaliki Naka. Um, Oh wait, what chords are in this one? A minor C. No, it's got E in it. I hate E. I can't. How much is it in there? That one looks like it might be required. And I don't have the time to find a different note to play. <laughs> but hey, it, I tried. Um, what, I, did I even tell y'all what that was? Um, what What child is this? Is the one I was just looking at, but yeah, there's an E in it. I, I can't do E's. Maybe one day, but I really need to practice them. Have I done Joy? Uh, yeah, I think Joy to the World was like the first one I did, right? Yeah, I think so. Hark the Herald Angels. Oh, that's got B minor in it. And E. Nope, skip. Just did that one. Away in a major. Oh, I like Away in a major. Let's see if that one's as easy as that says. Oh, what fresh hell is this? Oh, sorry. Um, I know this is Christmas time. This looks like, oh wait, maybe that'll work out. It all fits on one. I don't have to scroll. Okay, sorry. <laughs> this looks like a page out of a hymnal. Um, <laughs> it's got all is it three, yeah, all three verses just on top of each other with like the notes that you would sing uh, and then the chords are above all of that which I have some books that are like this so it's not like it's the first time I've seen this but it was just a shock because all the rest of them were not like this at all and I was just like wait wait huh am I gonna be able to play that okay I think so
This might be the last one. We'll see. We'll see. I'm gonna make sure I'm singing in there. Is that high? Yeah, that's kind of high. We'll try it. If, if my voice starts cracking, I might just do like one verse and call it a day. Okay, we'll, we'll see. What note is that? Uh, every good boy does. That's a high D. <laughs> okay, okay. I totally just changed verses, just like I used to do in church all the time. Uh, tender care and take, take us to heaven to live with thee there. I almost did that one without completely screwing it up, and it wanted me to do an extra little switcheroo at the end, so it'd be like, I wasn't gonna, I wasn't about to do that. Cause I can, but it's not, mm -mm. Like those chords are not close to each other. If it were like this and this, or the, this and that, mm -mm. there's plenty of other chords that are easy to transition from one another to, and that's not. Mm -mm. And it wanted me, okay, that was the other thing that like threw me for a loop for a second. Cause it said D7 on the other page, which it is, but they're showing me like, uh, complicated. Yeah. I think I've used that word several times. The complicated version of D7, which is like holding down three chords or er, mm, strings there and one there. Yeah. Which is, it sounds fine, but that sounds fine too. It's a little different. And I think in some songs it might make a difference, but in this one it didn't. And it's just two strings, with two fingers. It's so much easier. Why would you ever do the complicated one if you didn't have to? <laughs> yeah. So I was I was pulling some tricks there anyway. Uh, I think I already did Duck the Halls, right? And Jingle Bells. I'm not doing 12 Days of Christmas. Don't ask me to. I don't know Good King wants this list that well. Oh, Christmas tree. Oh my God, how many are on this page? Let me just see what the other ones even are. Coventry Carol? I don't even know what that is. Um, oh, I like that song, but that's got a B minor and an F sharp. Mm, pass. Uh, do you hear what I hear? Sorry. Up on the housetop. Oh, that's a cute one. But oh, that's the end. I may just end it with the one that sounded pretty. <laughs> I don't think I have any others, right? Uh, mm, what, what, what is this? Oh, this is just the same. Okay. There's several different sites that link back to the one I started on. Wait, did I do a Wish You Merry Christmas yet? 
I don't think I did. I think I can do this one real quick and then what, what? no chords. You got to move. <laughs> They're covering up the words. Oh, ah. just move a little. No. Wait, maybe I should look at the chords. I think they're all easy. It's got B in it, which is not my favorite. Okay, just to remind myself, B is this. How, how, how many times is B in this? Hopefully it's like once or never. Where, where's the B? Oh, there it is. Uh, okay, let, uh, yeah, but, I'm just gonna have to scroll, I think, at the end, and that's okay. Last song, y'all. Okay, you ready for this? <clears throat> I gotta get back to watching some Christmas movies. I just came off of watching Ernest Saves Christmas, and it was fantastic. That's why I should do Oh Christmas Tree, but I should do his version, which is just Oh Christmas Tree, Oh Christmas Tree, Oh Christmas Tree, Oh Christmas Tree. Oh Christmas tree, 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 oh Christmas tree. Do y'all like my fake playing? That's the only version of that song I will I will I will sing. Um But you gotta watch Ernest Saves Christmas if you haven't seen that movie. Come on! It's a classic. It's fantastic. Fantastic. So I'm gonna try this one and then go watch some more movies with my darling husband. Um, but this has been super fun and hold on, let me check back over and see if anybody has said anything else. Uh, where's the P? <laughs> I'm, I'm telling you, it's really hard to see. There's only, it's only like once in every other verse and it was just like, where are you? Where's the beef? That's, that's what I should have been saying. Okay, okay. Let's, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna try to go out wishing y'all a Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. And yeah, thanks so much for being here. I love y'all. Um, Here we go. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We, <laughs> oh dear. Wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Good tidings we bring to you and your kin. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Oh, bring us some biggie pudding. Oh, bring us some biggie pudding. Oh, bring us some biggie pudding and bring it out here. Good tidings we bring to you and your kin. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. We won't go until we get some. We won't go until we get some. We won't go until we get some. So bring Girl. Good tidings we bring to you and your kin. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. <laughs> so I didn't foresee how many changes were going to be in that one because it was written out in a funny way. It worked though. That was interesting. They put the chords in the same line as the words. So it's like, we, and in parentheses, G, wish you a Merry Chris Merry C Christmas. We, A, wish you a Merry D Christmas. We, B, wish you a Merry E minor Christmas. <laughs> but it works. I kind of like that. I might have to try that uh, next time I, I'm writing out songs. But they have it like links. Uh, uh, well, unless you're too far up and then it doesn't show. Wow, y'all need to code your website. What am I now? I'm on ukulele-tabs.com at this point. And their coding is good for the most part. Like you can hover, it looks like a link. I wonder what happens if you click on it. Does it go anywhere? No, it's just, uh, that's it. Hmm. I wonder how they did that by JavaScript or something. But if you hover over what looks like a link, which are the 
chords, it shows you the finger positions, or at least like three dots for D. It doesn't show you which fingers, like one, two, three, um, or this, however way you want to play it. It just shows you, it shows you which things need to be pressed down for that chord. But in the first verse, those don't work because it's hidden <laughs> by this music player. Uh, it's it's oh it's a music player and it's an ad. It says play We Wish You Merry Christmas on Amazon Music Unlimited ad. So their ads are making their site halfway unusable. <laughs> Whatever. I'm gonna stop complaining about crappy websites. Cause hey, you know what? They gave me some excellent songs to play for you folks. Uh <laughs> even if they were a little rough. You know, a couple of them were better than I expected. Some were worse than I expected. <laughs> but Gizmo says Merry Christmas to all. Um, and so do I. And my darling, wonderful husband, Adam, who gave up some time with me to let me come do this because I really wanted to. <laughs> uh, yeah, I hate not going anywhere for the holidays this year, but we're staying safe. Um, everybody else, you know, do what you're doing. Just please take extra safety precautions because Omicron is not messing around, y'all. It is so contagious, like super contagious. So just be extra careful because I, I don't want to lose any more people. I mean, I never want to lose any people, but especially from something like this that could be prevented. So please just, you know, you know, you know, by now, you know, the things to do. I don't need to remind you. Um, but just please be safe, be careful, and have a Merry Christmas. Like, whatever that entails for you. For us, that's watching a bunch of fun Christmas movies, including Die Hard. And don't at me if you don't think Die Hard is a Christmas movie. Um, and eating Christmas cookies that we made yesterday. And we'll probably make some more of because they're really good. Um, I made rainbow peanut butter blossoms. Like, I'm... Peanut butter blossoms are like my family's traditional Christmas cookie, but you just dip them in sugar. Like the you roll it up in a ball, you dip it in sugar, and then you put it on the cookie sheet, and whatever. So when I was a kid, quick story. Adam already knows this one. Um, <laughs> quick story before we go. Y'all know I have to like throw in some random chatter boxing at you. Um, we yeah, we just coated them in white sugar. And made them but at least one christmas maybe more than one we got the bright idea to make the sugar colored and so we made one bowl that was green and one that was red sugar um and we just used food coloring to do it and i thought surely this is an experience that like every kid from the 80s had or every family from any time i don't know i just i thought it was normal it, it never struck me as odd to put some food coloring like, just a little bit i think i my mom i'm sure is the one who put it in or i would have like dumped it in and it would have been way too much and then the sugar would have dissolved and been useless but anyway um yeah she legit put some food coloring in the sugar and then just like stirred it up real good and then we just rolled it in that that was colored sugar to me i didn't know you could buy colored sugar nope nope that knowledge was lost on me until my wonderful husband informed me that this was a thing that existed <laughs> and i didn't have to do it by hand if i wanted to make colorful cookies um so i did actually buy like one was a it's hard to call it a four pack but it, it's one round thing but it's got four sections in it so it has four different colors of sugar in it and then i got two was it two or just one extra color that it did not come in that yeah i think it was just one extra so i could do several cookies of each one color but they also had rainbow sprinkle sugar I mean, it is sugar it's not sprinkles but it's not as fine as just sh colored sugar it's a little more granular um so it's a bit mm, uh, mm, I'm losing words here, but you know, it's just it's a little bigger, a little chunkier, <laughs> chunky sugar. <laughs> that sounds disgusting. It's not, you know what I mean? It's just, it's somewhere between sugar and a sprinkle. It's not as big as a sprinkle by any means, but it's bigger than just regular grains of sugar. And I'm doing a horrible job 
describing this, but you can buy it. I got it at Harris Teeter. Um, and it was like full rainbow with some clear ones. So yeah, they're rainbow cookies and they're fantastic. They're actually maybe better with the the larger granul granular. Is that the, I don't know what I'm looking for. They're uh, sugar. So just a hint for anybody who makes peanut butter blossoms, the Hershey Kiss cookies with the peanut butter, you know, yeah, those. If you haven't had them, Google it. It's a thing. Um, aw, somebody's messaging me about He-Man. That's cute. I will check that after I sign off though. So yeah, I think that's it y'all. Um, I'm going to go eat some more rainbow peanut butter blossoms and we're going to watch movies and we're, and we're going to take a walk because it's going to be like 60 degrees or a little over 60 tomorrow. Yay. And sunny. Um, so that's how we're spending Christmas. But however you're choosing to spend it this year, I hope you're having a wonderful time with whoever you are with. And if that person is just yourself, give yourself a hug from me because I love you and I'm thinking of you and that's why I'm here. It's not just so I can have some fun. Although this was pretty fun. Um, no, I, I mm, hair. Um, yeah, I just wanted to put a little extra sprinkle of Christmas joy into the ether this year and whoever picks it up and enjoys it. Great. Have I really been going over an hour? Oh, dear Lord. I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> but for any little bit of this that y'all stuck around for, thank you. You're wonderful. You're beautiful. I love you. And as I've already said 10,000 times, I wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Bye, y'all. Yes, I do want to end it. <laughs>